No one's gonna say much to her. Yeah, that was that was kind of nasty. So Tina Charles, five points so far, two for four from the field as Odyssey Sims has to Natasha Cloud. Charles left alone on the three, and that time she doesn't make him pay, but it's close to a rebound for the Mystic. A, a quick breather, I'm assuming, here on the bench now. But a great defensive series for Atlanta on the other end. You can see the communication getting better with each game as well. Erin McDonald works it around the perimeter. A lot of contact drawn for Odyssey Sims. She said count it. That's the second personal foul for Natasha Cloud. Something to keep your eye out on as she picks a completely different player. To start the season, Atkins was 26% from the field in her first two games. She's 53% in her last three. She is just, I mean, playing with a lot of balance and, and confidence. I mean, Odyssey Sims. All this applause we've heard all afternoon. Got us out our seats in Odyssey Sims. You can see the energy continuing to flow from Atlanta. Back-to-back -back bucket. 10-2 run for Atlanta. Another turnover for the Mystics. Lights out. Tiana Hawkins knocking down a three. Steals on the defensive end. And you're seeing the life in Atlanta. But that's the way they want to play. And they've also got seven points off the offensive rebound. So those are important stats, along with the 18 points. He just checks in for Heinz Allen and turns the ball over at the top of the key. Swarming defense by Odyssey Sims. Takes it and delivers on the other end. So we'll see if she can return. But Atlanta right now rolling with an 18-point lead. Courtney Williams who has been fantastic. Another night scoring in double figures and Odyssey Sims continues in Italy for the clinch to get the eighth spot in the 2020 playoffs. So very interesting for Atlanta to come out so strong, especially without Kennedy Carter.